Hi guys, welcome back to another OGs guys. Are you all doing? If you are new here, you are welcome. And if you are returning, subscribe, God bless you. As you always come back to watch my video. My people know be smart, you know. Now, the phone is not the land for my table. And I know so as the news they come, that's so why they carry and come here out for to go share and with Alright, my people, for today video, I'm going to watch and together with Tana. Alright, my people, more could go watch the video to see what really they happen for inside the video, my people. Speak! But there are certain things that we just have to use our common sense if we have one to say. God. And again, me. Ah, a long bow. Mango, you let's see. We share no tea, but she lost share one. I like bone. And again, me share no tea, but she lost share one. You put a coat. To your bank, you be your bonny, your bonny, your bonny. Share no tea. We eti she mori. Anti ke mi, eti je e wari. Mi o badu ya ke tu lo je wale e kosi o. Because I wanted to mba fa yi, it's very unfair. This is not about giving those family now. It's about that young boy. The Nigerians are mourning. The mothers are mourning. He de jade. Hey, ti je komo yesu wala. You were even saying, pe, the video did not say, Apologize to you, and that was why that thing happened to him. And to me, he ma was he ma jeki. So we go me, we go me. We come and share your thing. You can take the logo. We ma da kelo logo. To the bank for me, we go meet him. We take the logo. We ma happen. Boya eh, take the logo ni. We ma take the logo ni. We ma ikamu yoma tasi ni all the time. We ma do me to buy points. Take me because I take me. Oh, can we go? I can't wait. I can't dream. I can't miss it. People are talking. Who cares? I said it. I said it. I don't care. I don't need. Ah, it's Kemi. It's Kemi. It's Kemi. It's Kemi. I'm going to come up with Nance 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 Kemi. I'm going to come up with from this is PR specialist. Okay, we're gonna continue the Adelaide curse. We're talking about throwing away children. Okay, some of she calls it Adelaide curse. Doctor Kemi Alunlo, a Nigerian journalist. From this is PR specialist. Okay, we're gonna continue the Adelaide curse. We're talking about throwing away children. Okay, some of this stuff is gonna be so shocking to you, but it's out there. I put these things online in 2018, 2019, but the whole notion was, don't even listen to that woman. She's crazy, she's mentally unstable. Don't even believe her. It's the same thing in November of when I told you guys that Morty did not enter that cold room. And again, people will call you, she's mad, she's sick, she, because of the way you are doing and again, you tagged it, the Adelike curse. When they've just lost a child, the child is still in cold room. The parents are still. They said one is in coma. We don't know. And you are tagging it a delicate curse. And to me, if people now remind you that you too, you have you have been you have been cursed from home. Me by the thirty one. How would you like it? And to me, kimo mo shukoni the only lawyer curse because your father sent you to the university. How you know you did all your 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 education here. But you went back, you were deported because of all this. Why you know? They call him the only lawyer cuss. Or come as a pay and to get me gone, but my family won't want to get you still. How would you feel? And to get me, except for number of 2019, when I told you guys that Kiki Morty did not enter that cold room, and the BBC sex for grades, and he said, No, she's just jealous. Kemi, you're jealous. She's a better journalist. Well, three years later, you see how they were fighting over it. Okay, and all of them. I tell you this since you don't pay attention, but it's on my YouTube channel. That's it. Throwing children away. So there was this woman in London. She's a makeup artist, and she said she had an affair with David or whatnot. She got pregnant, and David abandoned her. That's not new. David has already abandoned Imadi and Sophia. And Dilly Mamadu pushed the whole, let's get a DNA test. You fathered Imadi. And today, Imadi is like the main kid. All right, so is this, we're doing this again now? So this makeup artist, Larissa, she had a very famous celebrity friend, a very big one in Nigeria, music artist. 
And that music artist came to me and said, hey, Kemi, I want you to put this out because, you know, everybody uses my blog to get this stuff out. Did she pay me? No, she didn't pay me. This is stuff that is the blog which I did lots of money for. But I put the story out there. I want us to listen to her. incredible you. story. Okay, that there's a baby mom in London expecting a child for David. You guys remember now, 2019 when I moved to Lagos at that time. And of course, the same old mentality, this woman is unstable. When I put that story out, Gislava carried it after me. And at the end of the day, I had put the story out. I didn't put pictures out. Gislava and I put pictures of Larissa pregnant. Sometimes during that pregnancy, okay, during the pandemic, she went into labor. She couldn't get to the hospital. We're not allowed to go out in the pandemic. And the baby ended up being delivered in the house by someone in the girl's family. That celebrity came to me and told me this and another bunch of stuff came out. Okay, Larissa said there were some things she found out when confiding with Davido. Davido was apparently going out with Chioma. Somewhere behind that whole area is when they had that affair, a makeup artist in London. And she said Davido confided in some things with her and that information came to me. But Chioma had three separate abortions. She tried to conceive for Davido. Each time she conceived a girl, ultrasound. It's a girl, no, she don't want a girl. She wants a boy for Davido. So, you can imagine. Dr. Kemi, Kemi Lulaya, Nigerian journalist. Wait, Dr. Kemi Lulaya, Dr. Kemi Lulaya, wait, Dr. wait. So, she said, <laughs> Kemi, I can't go. Do you know what she said? She said, there was one girlfriend of um, Davido, you know that girl that had a child for Davido in uh, London. By the way, this guy, David, is such a wonderful father. Honestly, I see a trait of him in my son. My son too loves his children. So when I see the way he takes care of his children, I'm like, oh, it's just like my son. David Doe, in as much as he has, you know, plenty baby mamas and plenty children, the way he carries his children, the way he loves them, the way he pampers them, gives me goose pimples. He is a fantastic father to his children. So this is, of course, he can deny, and you know, boys, when they start sleeping with, uh, 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 my son will say, tell you, I didn't put it inside, it wasn't inside. That was what happened that time when he had the first one. Do you understand? So most of them will tell you that, you know, boys want to deny, like they want to deny a child, a child's paternity. But when the, the like, okay, now, of course, they will, they will accept when the chips are down. Do you understand? So, of course, they might have had any problem. But for you to say it was Davido that confided in that girl, his girlfriend, that Choma, you know, aborted for him three times because she was looking for a boy. How, how would somebody even think about that? And that's again, is it, only, it is only you that would always hear everything because you are an investigative journalist. With her and that information came to me that she only had three separate abortions. abortions. She tried to conceive for David. Each time she conceived a girl, ultrasound. It's a girl, no, she don't want a girl. She wants a boy for David. She got rid of three fetuses, female. She wanted a boy and she finally got pregnant with a boy. I remember that year I was the one that announced that Chioma is pregnant when they said she wasn't pregnant. I said, not only she's pregnant, she's expecting a boy. And at the end of the day, put two and two together. I know this job very well. She threw away three girls. Now her only boy, gone. You can imagine. See how she ended it. She threw away three girls. She threw away three girls. Now her only boy is gone. She did not only say this. Go to the TikTok and listen. And listen to Auntie Kemi. Auntie Kemi, you reminded us while this boy is in pain of losing a child, while he's grieving at this point, Auntie Kemi, you reminded us of how his mother died using drugs. You're sending a message to uh, Davido that when he comes out, he, when he's reviving, you want to bring him back to coma because you have opened up some wounds for him. This boy, at this point in time, has lost a child. He's in pain. He's grieving. 
Now, let's assume it's not because it's like it's no more in the world. Because his, his life has crumbled before him. Losing a child. You have now come to the whole world to tell us how Chioma, Chioma that is in pain, that is crying, has, you know, aborted three times. Auntie Kemi, have you never aborted? Have you never done any abortion before? Tell me the truth, Auntie. Have you not done one abortion before? I know you have aborted before. So why is it news? Why is it something that we have not seen before? Why is it as peculiar that you have to come and announce to the whole world that she did three abortion because she has gone in to do scan and the scan said it was a girl, three girls. And to get me, I don't know, maybe it's possible or now, I don't know. Because before they can determine, before they can determine the sex of a child, the photos in the, in the mother's womb, the child, uh, the, the, the pregnancy will have reached about four or five months. I don't know if it is not possible for three, four weeks for you to determine the sex of a child. To know the gender of that child. Because who come when Do you understand? So I don't know if it is possible for Chioma to have, you know, checked her own thing. Do you understand? Check her, you know, the pregnancy while it was only two, three weeks, four weeks. And she was able to they were able to determine the sex of a child for her. And then they knew that. First one was a uh, girl, second one girl, third one girl, and that was why she aborted because she wanted to have a boy for the video by all means. I mean, sometimes things like this, I mean, or maybe some medical people that are here, you understand? Maybe they will know better than me because, like I said, I am not a medical doctor, I'm not an investigative journalist, I'm just a boy that on online that's doing her thing. So, Probably, maybe, ah, per adventure, and see, Shoma went to check pregnancy at four, four weeks old, and they told her they are girls, first one girl, second one girl, third one girl, until the fourth one, immediately, the video put it there, she saw that it was a boy, it was a family that was coming, and she left it there. Some things do not make sense, and scare me. Honestly, Auntie Kemi, who that be pay? Me, he like come as a boy escape or goin? Who da? Who buyin now? Top a yansi, top a to lo buyi, top buyi lo si. He be top buyi London. He shall not see that he lo jewa. But we let him feel. But we let him feel. See the video by Jade. Auntie Bubu and we be. Come to buyi, top buyi lo si. He be top yaman, top buyi London. That he need post post trauma. But we let him feel. See Veronica, to my Jake, truly. Ah, I got for you, and today they said it's not possible, must be about six months before they know the gender of the child. And she came in four weeks, five weeks, two weeks. See, Chaba, but you know you buy, oh, theory. Like in Shaggy. I'll be sure my tooth is that Jenny. This is pure bullying. Nothing else. While somebody is still in pain, you came online to malign them, to destroy, to destroy their image. If truly you are standing as a friend to Veronica, who you have described as a friend of yours, Veronica, the late Veronica Imade, that you call her Imade, yeah, that is Davido's mother. If truly you are a friend, then you are a very bad friend, Ansi. Ansi, get me. You are a very, very bad friend. If one has a friend like you, then no need to have enemies again in life. Ansi, get me is enough as a, as a bad enemy and good friend. If truly she's your friend, because I know you are always attaching everybody is your friend. I know you are Molobo. I know you grew up in Ikoyi, you grew up in 
you know, high classes places, you went to good schools in the U in the US, you went to Abi UK, anywhere you studied. You know, you 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 rolled with the woo and woo in the society. So you're always saying everybody learn to get me more. Ah, anybody you mention. That's the only one and Skemi knows the person life for me. Well yeah, we grew up together in Nikoi. The, the, my, my, my neighbor is my neighbor. The um, daddy is my neighbor. My daddy is my neighbor. And Skemi is my neighbor. Let's see if you can tell me. You can tell me more. We will not be surprised. And Skemi, we remember how you destroyed your own family. You talked about your father, telling us how your father used your brother for rituals. It's still on online. It's still online, Nancy. You called your dad a ritualist. You called your father a ritualist. You said he used your junior brother that had an accident. He used him. You call all your family members different names. You called your mother a witch. So we can still remember that. And that is the solace we have on Davido's issue. That whatever you say will be taken with a pinch of salt. Whatever you say about Davido or his child or his girlfriend. Do you understand? Whatever you, you are saying about them, we just take it with a pinch of salt that and take me to be again. Nobody will trust you, nobody will believe whatever you say again. Because when you come out now, you will say, Yes, it's true. Eh, I told I told, I talked about my family. I told you will be speaking on you, but I go. So I will burn them we. I will kill Shamekana. So sometimes it's gonna burn them we. I come out for a bad big baby after pass on you. David will come out. Harry Beshi so pay yawn. Drug lo pay yawn. E de pe ra yi lo re. Show da ko re mi. Ko tu bo gwa shiri mi ti ma ti kouton. Fan ra ye. Ko pe yon mo mi joko. And then the only accusation you're always putting on David o is the fact that he called, he said you should go add oil your pussy. And ti ke mi. Ki le yi no so tofi ti ti David is ofin pe ke lo ho yi pussy ni. Can you move on to the next day? You want me to talk about the next day? Come on, get ready to go join Koni and see. Hello, why are you feeling so comfortable? Or to what are you? It's because of the way you have presented yourself to David. Because you are a blogger, because you are a journalist, does not make you put yourself as a rag. You don't put yourself down because you are a journalist or you're online. So to ask people who are online, but who are making money, at a balaba, I go to marry a young female. I'm thinking about people feeling sick, but what? What I'm feeling sick, what? I'm more when you're talking about Yabon. I'm more Yabon, she's more Woyin. I'm more Yabon, she's more Woyin. Cut on your phone, cut on your phone, cut on your phone. We're going to share money, but not but not Woyin. Woyin, Tiana, to figure out your birthday, phone enjoying. Because that was how you lied. That was how you lied on her. We pumped up past us. At the end of the day, we believe we have cash or blue. See you later. We want to ask you to tell us why. Tell us why. We have cash or blue. At the bank, post trauma. You need PSTD. You need. See your baba, you so yeah, yeah, yeah. She's calling me. Stop calling me, Kem Kem. Stop calling me, Kem Kem. I have PSD. I have PCSD. I have P. Ah, and today me kill all day. And you never come and eat trauma again. She has fallen out with Tony Lawani. Why would she fall out with Tony Lawani? Toba ya, just love my queen. And today me a gym month. Today me a gym month. Tell me a gym month. You know man, be me to ask. Mati kaki ni. Tell me a gym month, man. Oh, jeans lover, jean lover. Why calling and tell me gym months? Tell me at what at what circle? 
Inu ba gini ati kemi shamu kuba gini tebang bebi agbe koi. Awa sakule ari moti inu ba gini kini moti she inu ba gini ati kemi. Inu lo party lo unju moti inu ba gini. Lo unju moti inu ba gini. Ati go eba lo tibe ini kemi aji moti. Kemi aji moti. Kude si ni tebe makpari bugu awa ni. You only TikTok, you go and tell me when you finished talking about these people that you brought them down so much. The next thing you said was, uh, you push you donate for me, oh, donate for me, oh. I, 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 I need money. I did it, 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 and if you are never subscribed, you can subscribe so that you don't go miss any latest we are the upload. On a bye bye till I come on a winner's time. Bye guys, guys. My next video. Bye guys.